Sony Cine PlayStation's killer feature is still doing well for Sony Cine PlayStation has a big features that currently only available on PS4 and PS4 Pro consoles. Other gaming machines currently can't offer virtual reality, although things could change as in the future. Microsoft Xbox One X is supposedly getting some form of VR support in the future, although the tech giant seem focused on the PC platform at this time. The Nintendo Switch, meanwhile, has had some interested patents found connected to VR, although the chances of it seeing the light of day seem slim. And while it may seem beneficial to wait and let the virtual reality space grow with new tech before jumping in, Sony are doing quite well already. The tech giant announced earlier this month that they have a hardware upgrade planned for PS4 gamers who use the PlayStation VR. This new PSVR model headset has been confirmed for North America and will offer a range of new tweaks to improve quality of use. Tuesday, June 13, 2017 gameplay footage from Spider-Man on the PS4 was shown at E3 2017. This includes features such as enabling the stereo headphone cables to be integrated with the VR headset and a slimmer, streamlined connection cable. There is also an updated processor unit that supports HDR pass-through, meaning users will be able to enjoy HDR-compatible PS4 content on a TV without having to disconnect the processor unit in between the TV and the PS4 system. However, Sony warns that this function can be used only when the VR headset is turned off. Model number CUHC VR2 has not been announced for Europe, so it's unclear if this version will be available in the UK anytime soon. It recently hit shops in Japan and made a pretty immediate impact. Having hit shops just a week ago, the revised PSVR headset sold 27,000 units in its first week in the country, that can't be considered shabby by anyone's standards. This was reportedly the second biggest week since its official debut in the region, when PlayStation VR sold 52,000 copies. Right now, Japanese sales show over 200,000 units sold in Japan, however, the new sales did not help push more PS4 off shelves. Still, it helps highlight just what kind of impact having a VR console feature can have when it comes to hardware sales. Over the same period, the Nintendo Switch sold 40,803 units, although this would have likely been higher if more stock was available. Microsoft Xbox marketing manager, Albert Pinello, was recently asked about VR on Xbox One X, hinting that more could be revealed next year. Well talk about VR when that happens, Pinello replied when asked by TechRadar, for us, we're focused this year on the X launch. There's already so much we're asking developers to do. We've said that we're building for VR. Obviously Microsoft as a company is super invested in VR. For Xbox this year, it's just not what we're talking about. There's always new things to talk about in the future.